is Hannah McAndrew, skin specialist based down in South Wales, also an educator for Nunu Skin Technology. It's a beautiful sunny day today, so I brought myself outside to make this video all about the importance of SPF. Now you'll be glad to know that I'm in the shade behind me and under my trees. As we know, UVA and B are very, very damaging to the skin. UVA is there all year round, even in the winter. It can get through glass as well, so it's, you're subjected to that indoors. And that's the one that does most of the ageing on the skin. So things like wrinkles, loss of collagen, sagging of the skin, pigmentation as well. An uneven skin tone can be caused by that ray. You've got your UVB rays as well, which are there um, more so in the summer, which can cause things like sunburn. And also both of them can eventually lead to skin cancer as well. So we need to make sure that we are protecting our skin at all times from both of these rays, particularly in the summer when the sun is at its strongest. So the product that I'm going to be focusing on today is our Nanu Tinted SPF 40. You can see I've taken this one from my uh, tester stand. And it's actually tinted, so it's like a tinted moisturiser. And it's available in three different shades. So I've got the light one here today, and it's actually also available in medium and dark as well. So if you were a client coming in, we'd have a choice of sachets for you, light, medium, dark. So you can make the choice as to what um, shade you might be. They are just a colour wash, and I will be showing you an application um, and also the colours on the back of my um, arm today as well. So you can have a little idea as to roughly where you might sit. Personally, I find they come up slightly darker than you'd expect. Um, so me, for example, I'm like the fairest person that I know, bar maybe one or two other people, and the light is actually a little bit too deep for me. And so it's better for me in the summer when I want to look like I've got that kind of glow but without obviously damaging my skin. Nimu actually make this SPF 40 in a clear as well, which is our best seller. And um, we also make a 50 in a clear, which has got other benefits I'll discuss on a different video. But the 40 I find sells particularly well at this time of year because it's nice when you don't want to wear makeup to go outside in case it's too hot and your makeup's all going to slide off. And it's also really good if you want to give yourself that little pop of colour without having to use like a self-tanning product or actually expose your skin to the sun because as we know that is incredibly damaging. So, so this is a Factor 40 sunscreen. It's UVA and B filter because we know both of those rays are damaging to the skin. Both can cause skin cancer, but we know it's the UVA that does the bulk of the damage when we're talking about the aging of the skin. So things like wrinkles, sunspots, uh, pigmentation as well. There's actually a whole load of antioxidants in here. So you've got encapsulated vitamin C and vitamin A. And there's some really nice oils that give the skin those essential uh, fatty acids. So I find my drier skin clients tend to prefer this one over the Factor 50 that we make. However, the Factor 50 doesn't come in a tint. It just comes in clear. We use both chemical and physical SPF ingredients in our products because we want to have the best of both worlds. We need that high factor rating to protect the skin, but we also don't want to overload the skin with too many chemicals that are going to make the skin too warm, and that could potentially aggravate like a sensitive skin or um, anybody who suffers with a heat rash, for example. So let's have a little look at the different shades that we have available then. I'm going to show them to you on the back of my arm. I'm not sure if we can see the colours very well here. So I've got closest to my elbow, I've got the light there. So that blends in quite well with my skin tone there. It's like a, like a sort of light beige colour. Then we have the medium, which is a bit warmer and obviously a little bit deeper as well. And then we have the dark then, which I'd say is actually a little bit cooler uh, in tone than the medium. It's more of like an, an olivey tone on this one. Um, but nevertheless, it is darker. Remember though, they are like a colour wash. So we'll see in a second how they apply. I've added in this still, which shows the pictures closer once the product has dried. I haven't got any makeup on today except for a little bit of under eye concealer because nobody wants to see me without that. Um, and like I said, we're just going to achieve that colour wash. So how we apply in this then is very, very similar to how you'd apply any clear sunscreen. So you need to use a lot of it and you need to get it absolutely everywhere. <laughs> so I'm going to do all around my eyes as well, which is quite nice because I like that coverage there. So about a teaspoon is generally what we'd say if you are out and about. And obviously we'd recommend like hat glasses as well. So I've got quite a fair amount there. So onto both of my hands. And literally get it everywhere. So you don't want to be just kind of rubbing in with the ends of your fingers. You want to get this absolutely everywhere. 
so all around the eyes as well over the eye area because personally for me that is my most aged area I think most people would agree with that it's where we start seeing the first signs of aging so you want to get your SPF protection there do your ears as well if nothing else just to color match the rest of you but obviously your ears are susceptible so I haven't quite used my um, my teaspoon yet I probably used about half so let's go for a little bit more to do my neck and chest then because they are exposed And this is great because obviously you just look like you've got a little bit of a colour without having to, to damage your skin. So I said I can get up around the back of my neck as well. You could put a bit of clear there if you you know if you don't want to waste your your tinted. In terms of pricing though, they, they're not that much more expensive for the tinted versus the clear. So there we go. I just look a little bit healthier. Um, you could put like a mineral powder over the top if you want even more protection, even more colour. I might do that so I've got quite an oily skin, which you know if you follow my channel. And I absolutely love Jane Iredale powders, um, which are actually available now on my website, which is hannahmcandrew.com. Thank you very much for joining me today. I hope this video answers a lot of your questions about our Nimnu SPF Tinted. If you'd like a sample, please email me, info at hannahmcandrew.com. If you would like to book a consultation, these can be done online at hannahmcandrew.com. Or when we are back open from April the 12th, 2021, you can come in and see me in my clinic in Port Hall by appointment only. Again, all appointments can be booked on the website, which is hannahmcandrew.com. Thank you, and I look forward to seeing you on another video again soon. Thank you.